startled me. Do you mind knocking before you barge in? I'm sorry. Is that better? I've lost it. You lost what? I have lost my favourite fly. I had it in my hand a moment ago. I must have dropped it. Can you see it anywhere? What does it look like? Well, it's about two inches long, red and black, and it's got a curly tail. That's... <laughs> Perhaps it's flown out the window. It is a fishing fly, a cocky bondu. A cocky what? Bondu. <laughs> oh. It must be here somewhere. Oh, well, if it's here, we'll find it. Oh, well, perhaps I should come back later. Oh, Mr. Brown, you can join in. Yeah. Well, I'm not really that religious, actually. <laughs> we are looking for a fly. A fly? Oh, yes, it's a two inches long, brown, red and black, and uh, got a curly tail. Sounds quite lethal. Oh, would you mind helping us look for no, it? No, not at all. Oh, I found it. Where? It's here, just under the desk. Oh, I'll get it. No, stand back, Sid. You leave this to me. What are you doing, Mr. Brown? Just stay where you are, Miss Courtney. This could be dangerous. Yeah, that's great. Right. <laughs> Mr. Brown. Uh, just a minute. Better to be safe than sorry. Ah! <laughs> oh, I've just remembered. I haven't inspected the boilers. <laughs> Have you quite finished, Mr. Brown, or would you like to borrow a hammer? You can't be too careful where strange insects are concerned. Do you have any idea where it came from? Yes, W. Parker and Son. Uh, pardon? Fishing tackle suppliers. Oh, fish... It wasn't... It was. Oh, dear. Got any glue? I don't think trout are very fond of glue. No, I suppose they don't. I'll buy you another. Oh, I see that you do. Excuse me. Hello? Speaking. Pardon? Is it you? Is it really you? It is you. It's him. <laughs> what, you get, get, coming here? You, you, well, you're not coming here. You, you are coming here. He's coming here. <laughs> You'll be here in half an hour. He'll be here in half an hour. No, 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 no. Until then. Are you feeling all right? That was him. Yes, he's coming here in half an hour, but who is him? I mean, who is he? Well, this is a man I never thought I'd see again. My ex fiance You mean you were actually engaged at one time? Well, there's no need to sound so surprised. <laughs> but it was over 25 years ago. I mean, I mean, I was just... Well, I was very young. I mean... Excuse me, Mr. Brown, the old dragon wants you. Please, Sid, do be a bit more respectful, especially in front of the students. It's up to us to set a good example. I'm oh, sorry. Now, what does the old dragon... Uh, Miss Courtney... <laughs> I've no idea, but I don't think she's very well. She actually smiled at me. <laughs> you feeling all right? Yes, why? It sounds as if you're in pain. I was singing. <laughs> I am sorry to bring you away from your class, Mr. Brown, but before you leave this evening, would you mind checking that Sid's locked up properly? Absolutely. So he should be. <laughs> <laughs> I was referring to the building. You see, it is quite likely that I may be leaving early. <laughs> oh, to think he's come back in my life after 25 years. I think I need another sherry to uh, settle my stomach. <laughs> What's the matter? He's here! Look! Where? Down there! Oh! Oh! You stupid fool! You have crowned my Albert! <laughs> Terrible! I've got a splitting headache. Oh, look, I am sorry. It was an accident. Look, this is Miss Courtney's office. Uh, oh, uh, wait a minute. Look, have you got somewhere where I could comb my hair and brush myself down? I must look presentable for our first meeting after 25 years. Yes, of course, sir. Straight down there on the right. Uh, thank you. Enter. Hello, darling. <laughs> It's you. Oh, where's Albert? You haven't pushed him down the stairs, have you? No, 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 he's just gone to comb his hair. Well, is he 
all right? There's no damage, I hope. Well, I'm afraid there is, actually. Oh, dear. Is it bad? Well, the plant pot's broken. <laughs> I was referring to Albert. Oh, Albert. No, no, no. He's, he's fine. I'll get it. Darling. Oh, it's you. <laughs> yes, uh, this is Darling. Uh, Miss Courtney. Albert. Dolores. Dolores. <laughs> You a class to attend to? It's of course, darling. Dolores. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> uh, must, uh, Dr. 2P must have rolled away somewhere. <laughs> and then I shall come back and take you to dinner somewhere, just the two of us. <laughs> that would be lovely. Don't go away. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you going? Albert? Everything all right, sir? Hey? Everything all right? I've just seen a fellow I haven't seen for years, Albert Collins. Oh, Albert, Miss Courtney's boyfriend. Never. I'm getting married in the morning. <laughs> Get her. Uh, Miss Courtney, I'm afraid I've got some rather disturbing news. Oh, nothing you could say to me today would disturb me, Miss Bryce. Well, I think this might. It's about Albert. Ah, Albert, my future husband. Yeah, you see, I've just been talking to Sid and... Husband? Yes, we're getting married by special license. Oh, no. Oh, now, Mr. Brown, I know you're fond of me, but you mustn't take it. Has <laughs> he tried to borrow any money from you? And I fail to see what business that is of yours. He has. Look, I hate to have to tell you, Mrs. Courtney, but your future husband is a crook. Don't be so impertinent. It's true, I'm afraid. He's, he's a con man. He specialises in proposing to lonely women and then taking their money. Oh, nonsense. I don't believe it. Well, ask Sid. His brother-in-law was in prison with him. Prison? Are you sure? I'm afraid so. Well, perhaps he's reformed. Oh, come on, you don't believe that, do you? No. I thought it was too good to be true. He's coming back to take me out to dinner. What shall I do? Don't worry, Miss Courtney. I'll deal with him. You just leave everything to me. Ah, I've got a message for you from Miss Courtney. Oh, yes. Push off. <laughs> what? Look, I know all about your little game, so I advise you to get lost quick before I throw you out. You and whose army? Me and this army. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, yeah, well, um, <clears throat> perhaps I had better be going. <laughs> Courtney, he's gone. Oh, thank you, Mr. Brown. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>